Alrighty guys, so one of our next booths that we're doing is Oceaneering and we have a special guest, Matt. How you doing, Matt? Doing very well, thank you. And uh, you have a fantastic company and you guys work with a lot of big names in the industry. So what exactly are we here for and what is this vehicle system that I see right here? So this is Evo 6. Evo 6 is a tracked dark ride system. This one is uh, capable of uh, holding six passengers. It's fully customizable um, and what that means is uh, you know it, it comes with three degrees of freedom. That's pitch, yaw, and roll. 360 degree continuous spin. You can upgrade the system essentially putting like uh, interactive gaming on board where you have like the guns like you see in the Justice League attraction uh, at Six Flags. Which I actually just had a chance to do in Texas. I well, thought it was fantastic. That Using this vehicle. So same ve yep. vehicle system there. Yep. You can also upgrade the uh, audio system. Right now, every Evo 6 standard comes with a 2.1 in the front row and in the back row. That can be upgraded to 7.1. It really just comes down to speaker placement. The other big thing that's customizable about the vehicle is Oceaneering owns everything under the hood, so to speak. Yeah. Everything you can see, though, in the cabin can be customized. So you can do a different cabin shape. You can, uh, you know, paint job. Like I said, the audio system, you you know, there are so many different things you can do. So, creatively, uh, the sky's the limit. And it's not just a six passenger vehicle. You guys can do dozens of people, can't you? We, yeah, we can. Uh, we have, we, we can do, we can do a lot of different things. I mean, generally, if you can dream it up, we can, we can make it happen. It's all about, you know, how much money do you want to spend in development, yeah. that sort of thing. How fast do you want to spend? <laughs> exactly, yeah, yeah, that's right. So we have this neat vehicle system. You said it is fully customizable. Yeah. Now, I remember you saying there's something over here, actually, yeah. where there's different vehicle skins. So there's a hot rod, there's a dragon, there's something that looks like an army vehicle here. Right. So this shows just how customizable it is. It's not yeah. just one thing. You, yeah. can, you can theme it all over to several different things all over. That's so. right. Now, these, these are just uh, artist representations um, of what you could do. These don't represent anything that are currently in production. It's really just to give you an idea of what you know, what direction you could go in. Okay. So, uh, but yeah, it's fully customizable and sky's the limit. Um, would you like to see her in action? Yes, if you don't mind. Yeah, if you go around the front. Yep. This is Evo Six. So you're gonna see, so you're gonna get a sense right now of the of the three degrees of freedom, the pitch, the yaw, and the roll. Surprise. And uh, the show programming really, you know, follows the creative. Typically, for those of you out here, you know, out there that know, uh, in, in theme park ride development, you start with a creative group. Uh, creative group comes up with the stories and the, you know, the what the guest experience is going to be. And that's copy and it's storyboards and all that kind of stuff. So there may be an attraction where our vehicle is needed. It's determined at that time, should it be a tracked vehicle or a trackless vehicle? What's the sensation you want uh, to feel? Uh, do you want to feel like you're floating through space? Do you want to feel like you're you know, sliding across ice? And then our programmers uh, work with the creatives in, in, um, in development to, to ensure that the guest experience is what you want it to be creatively. Now, what kind of technical services do you guys offer when it comes to these kind of ride systems? Are you talking from very beginning, you yeah. know, the programming all the way to full ride installations? What kind of services does Oceaneering do? Yeah, so so we like to get involved as early as possible. And the earliest possible phase is Blue Sky. Blue Sky being the idea phase where you're really talking to creatives and, you know, operators sometimes about, okay, here's what we have in mind. We like to get integrated early on and, and help creative storytellers understand what our vehicle is and what its capabilities are. Um, what you can help achieve, you know. Uh, so, as far as what we offer, it's, it's mainly design and engineering and integration. And we also have like post post commissioning services as well, service and warranty, that kind of thing. Absolutely, and you've got a ton of projects coming up this next year with Six Flags and all their Justice Leagues. We're yep. very excited to see all those kind of projects. Like I said, I just had one personally to, uh, to do, and of course, over Georgia, yep. they're installing one as well, and we're gonna be up there checking that one out. So, very excited to see these ride vehicle systems. We guys know you do some fantastic products, and we cannot thank you enough for speaking with our guest, yeah. Matt, so really appreciate it, and we look forward to seeing what you guys have in the future. Thank you, thank you.